Okay, y'all. Hey, let's get into this intuitive reading, this intuitive message, this tarot card reading, tarot card message for Kai Senate. Okay, this reading is alleged and for entertainment purposes. Sometimes it's see it's hot, sometimes it's not. You have to watch the video to the end to determine for yourself. If you're new <clears throat> here, welcome. And if you're always here, welcome back, friend. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Okay, so let's get right into it. Spirit is acknowledging that in his current energy field, there is a lot of emotion and or he could be a water sign. There's an energy of him having ups and downs as everyone does in life, right? But more importantly, these ups and downs coupled with this water has his boat, which equals direction for me, stalled. There's an energy of pause. There's an energy of delay. There's an energy of halt. OK, and this is for him to take reflection, to take um, accountability and responsibility for why he is here. There is a treasured objective. OK, all right. Spirit is also acknowledging that his boat is stalled because there's this energy of someone hankering, luring um, energy into the water. Um, with a temptation. This could be a temptation of intimacy, um, a proposition, a proposal, a message of love, adder. But again, thank you, Spirit. There's water here acknowledging that this could be a water sign and or this could just be emotional. But it's luring someone in um, to this to this water, to this abyss, to this emotional, uh, this very draining energy, um, knowing that the other cannot fight for themselves, knowing that the other could not possibly even survive. OK, and spirit is acknowledging that this has to do with a hotter than blue blazes romance. The intuition is on the bottom. So there is an energy of uh, Kai acknowledging like he's not listening to his higher intuition when it comes to this matter. Um, this has something to do with sexual uh, energy because we see the sacral uh, energy here. We also see solar plexus energy. So it's the fire and one Spelly could also acknowledge that this is a fire sign, passionate, but yet chaotic in the area of business, but also in the area of romance. And this is affecting the heart chakra. OK, um, Spirit is also acknowledging again, we see boats because of this energy. He's putting his boats into the water, trying to gain direction. He's putting many boats into the water, trying to gain direction because initially, remember, it's stalled. There's a pause here. And so he's trying to figure out which way to go. Fulfillment, enthusiasm. Should he follow bliss and money? Should he fo follow passion projects or should he just do him? It's raining cats and dogs, but this is a temporary intensity, which is requiring him to surrender, release, and have a cleansing. Spirit is acknowledging, though, in regards to this, it's something that he keeps trying to have over and over and over again. There's something that he's seeking. It's something that he wants. Cats have nine lives. This makes me feel like the brouhaha. Now, when I say brouhaha, that is what I'm, when I reference that, I'm stating that someone is trying him and or someone else is trying to get somebody off of their righteous path because they want them there because there's some kind of um, need or assistance and with them on their path they can control it it's, it's very manipulative the thing about it is if it's not supposed to be a part of their righteous path then eventually they will come off of this path but not without a fight not without problem not without chaos not without upheaval and so my suggestion is to leave people the hell alone, okay, I, to be quite frank, and let people make their own choices. Don't make choices for them, but that's not my business and that's not my problem. Again, the higher intuitive energy, the higher intuitive chakra is on the bottom. It should be on the top. Thank you, Spirit. Just acknowledging that um, he's not listening to his, his guides, his inner guides, his higher intuition, and that creates a problem for him. Again, this reading is alleged and for entertainment purposes, um, but he's seeking uh, receptivity. He's seeking breakthrough. He's seeking solution. There's something that he wants, hence why he keeps um, energies such as this on his path, because they bring something for him to him. But it's not his righteous path. These are not people that should be upon his path. This is not his righteous path. Spirit just keeps acknowledging that, sending him love and light. Spirit said there's something else in the middle of the deck. <sighs> Spirit said that there is going to be a moment of clarity for him, that there's going to be a situation that he's going to get out of and grow through. And he is going to be very thankful and he's going to be humbled. He feels very humble in this energy moving forward. Thank God I got out of that. Thank God I grew through that. This is earth sign energy. This is uh, affecting the heart chakra, the root chakra, non-negotiables, boundaries, even um, the area of finances. Okay. Sending him love and light. All right, when it comes to Kai Senate, thank you, Spirit. What's the T? There's some burning of evidence, fire sign energy in the area of business, also in the area of passion, passionate, but yet chaotic. So there's some energy of him burning evidence. Spirit is acknowledging this is toxic for you. 
And Spirit says is this has to do with some form of sexual protection. Could even be sexual act. Sending him love and light. What is the message to Kai Senate? Thank you, Spirit. We do get the mother of air in reverse. Boundaries, second time I say that word um, so far in this reading. That's resonating. Boundaries is in reverse. Air, negative thinking, disorganized, not organized, not putting things together. I'm not thinking clearly. Spirit is acknowledging haters going to hate. The pessimistic energy is thick and undeniable. That chill in the air is somebody being cold, blooded, bitter, and maybe even cruel. Words can be more hurtful than sticks and stones. Being mean and nasty is never called for you are being overwhelmed by your emotions sending him love and light he needs to get his emotions intact but there's an energy of someone being mean nasty and cruel if it's not him someone else in his energy field what is his current energy kai senate kai senate i don't know if i'm saying his name right or wrong you can put it phonetically if you want to in the comment section i don't follow him i don't subscribe don't know him. This reading is alleged. Kai Senate current energy. Thank you. Okay. We do get inspiration in reverse. Three zero zero three. Okay, spirit. Feels like a mirroring number, no matter which way you look at it, it says the same, forward or reverse. Um, the number, that's, that's what I'm referencing. Six is significant. Spirit is acknowledging in reverse. There's a fear of expression holding him back. Hard times may be coming. He needs to be prepared. There's an energy of ego getting in the way of his pure creativity. And there's also an energy of past struggles coming back up. He needs to affirm and reconfirm, I am creating my dream life. And he can do that through feeling supported in his venture speaking his truth um, okay. actualizing his dreams thank you spirit and acknowledging that abundance of creative energy is around him if he chooses to i tell you guys all the time we have the power of choice your choice is important is spirit said imperative it's important and what you choose is your business good choices equal good karma bad choices equal bad karma okay spirit is acknowledging blackberries for is significant i don't know why spirit said the black of the better the sweet black of the berry the sweet of the juice there's an energy of agency and independence it's time to move forward with something you have been hesitant about it's, it's go time you can't keep dragging your feet with this one it is also a favorable time to travel this card marks the abundance of something that is ready to nourish you richly giving you the agency to pursue big goals that fulfill your own ideas are you fulfilling someone else's ideas but it's time he's been hesitant about moving forward and it's time, okay? Kai Sinet. Or is it Kai Sinat? I don't know. All right. Current energy. All right, there's an energy of domination, excessive control, rigidity, and inflexibility with the emperor. Aries energy in the area of romance, it feels like, but this is energy. This fire is burning low, so it's fizzling out in the area of business and also in the area of passion. Passionate, but yet chaotic um, in his energy field. And this is subconsciously affecting his coin. It's affecting how he feels. There's an energy of someone being down to earth. There's also an energy of someone collecting a coin on his behalf. So say there's an issue, they're going to get paid off of him he's going to have to pay somebody because of an issue that's what spirit is trying to say and it feels like a female energy i'm seeing a female here a lot of solar plexus energy acknowledging ups and downs acknowledging that windy path that i was talking about um trying to get grounded and rooted at the heart wanting peace but acknowledging that someone is feeling like okay i had to get this coin they got that coin too okay not my business not my problem in the middle of the deck spirit is acknowledging and this is because there is a resistance to change on his part with the death card in reverse scorpio energy water sign could be emotional and or could not could just be a water sign but spirit is acknowledging that there's an, an inability for him to move on because of this but he doesn't want to change and so when you don't adapt to the changes that are happening within your environment um what happens next the environment is changing and you're not you're just gonna stand still and, and not evolve not my business i'm just asking a question okay moving forward what is his biggest obstacle 
Thank you, Spirit. My very biggest obstacle in reverse. Cannot move on as an obstacle. Carrying baggage is an obstacle. With the Seven of Swords, I see water sign energy. I see air sign energy. Okay. Another big obstacle in reverse is the Judgment card. Not taking accountability and responsibility for your actions because he was refusing to see himself. A refusal of self-examination is an obstacle and self-doubt with Judgment in reverse. And then here goes that card again with the Queen of Pentacles, Earth sign energy in reverse. There's an energy of imbalance in work and family that's an obstacle okay sending him love and light what's next for kai senate thank you um, what's next is heartbreak, okay, with the Three of Swords. He's trying to get organized around this heartbreak. He's acknowledging that he's trying to get ahead of it. Feels like PR, feels like PR, feels like PR. Someone help him, someone fix it, clean up woman that's coming through. Um, I'm feeling all the clean up energy, fix this, fix this, fix this, okay? But there's an energy of painful separation around this heartbreak, sorrow, heartbreak, grief, and rejection. There's also an energy of trying to focus in on the coin. I'm done with this heartbreak, but I also got to focus on my money. I have to save my money. I have to hoard my money. I have to make sure that my money is here and it doesn't move. It's, it's stable. There's an energy of possession, security. There's an energy of deep-seated issues with a person and or people um, with possessions. Um, there's some past issues that he has not gotten over or not grown through. There's an energy of him seeking control, in fact, as he moves forward. Spirit is also acknowledging that this is going to be a juggling act for him. And it feels like he's going to lose money. Second time I've said this, it also feels like there's a breakdown in his foundation in the area of communication also in his heart chakra he doesn't have enough boundaries and or non-negotiables people keep stepping over his boundaries sending him love and light this is being communicated upon but this is some form of negative communication he almost feels like he's under attack in fact spirit is acknowledging with the two of pentacles in reverse disorganization financial disarray sending him love and light now we sit back and let the universe do what the universe does